other thing that you accomplished in the music industry? Um, shit, I really don't be trying to think how much I like accomplished because I feel like I ain't accomplished too much. You mm-hmm. feel me? I feel like I got a lot more to go. But. So, goal wise, what's a three to four month goal that you want to set for yourself? I mean, to me, my biggest accomplishment was like just coming when I came. I came home from my bed. I came home and it was this the end of COVID. Like right after the shutdown, I wasn't even home when they did the shutdown shit. Like I came home to that and how everything was different. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So for me, for me, it was like coming home, adapting, getting used to everything, and still being able to do what I did and and keep going and be blessed to keep doing what I love to do. That, that was my accomplishment, you feel me? And it's working, so I'm gonna just keep doing it. You have kids? Yeah, How I, got many? My, I got one, I got my son. Mm-hmm. How has it been a dad as well as an artist? It, it's, you know, it's, it's just another responsibility, mm-hmm. you know, it's a little hard, you gotta balance everything, you gotta balance everything out, you know? You gotta handle this and some, and handle also being a father and everything. Mm-hmm. So Would you let your son listen to your music? Yeah, definitely. Mm-hmm. Definitely. Are you, is he in like to music as well or like are you encouraging him to like get into that or is that something I you mean he's do? he's about to be two mm-hmm. in July so he's still a little baby. You know? <laughs> so he's got a while, got a while. Yeah, yeah, yeah he's still got a while but I would definitely let him listen to my music mm-hmm. so, so. Like think about having any more kids or you kinda like nah I'm good. I mean if, for now, I'm, just, I'm gonna go with myself, so. Mm-hmm. Yeah, definitely. Thanks. If you could change anything about the music scene, what would it be? If I could change anything about the music scene? Um, probably change, like, I don't know, I feel like it should be, like, more more chances like for artists you know what i'm saying like it's kind of like hard for artists to get on like coming like you know what i'm saying in mm-hmm. like i feel like it should be like an equal platform for everybody you feel me but um and also like more more a little bit more competitive like now like i feel like you can say whatever on the track yeah. as long as like it sounds cool i guess that's in like I, I like like the lyrics and shit like I like when people like actually saying something. Mm-hmm. Talking that shit. Yeah, facts, facts. So do you feel as though like with new music nowadays, like do you think it's substance? Like do you think it's gonna change? Um, do you think that it's gonna stay the same? Um, is there hope for any music or? Um, uh, no, nah, it's definitely gonna change. Music always changes. Like you know what I'm it's always gonna be a different sound that come out change this shit like when Pop Smoke came out he came out with that voice like that was distinct like started up some whole new shit you feel me mm-hmm. so it's always like a sound that's gonna come out like you know what I'm saying Kodak got his own sound that shit is fire somebody else gonna come out with a sound so it's just like that's where it goes to I stay original I try to stay original cause I want people to hit me and be like oh nah there's only one person that sound like that like, you sound like that you sound like him you feel me so, Definitely. So on the label side of things, you're obviously independent. Are you looking to lock in with any labels? Do you strictly want to stay independent? I mean, I want to, for now, I want to stay independent and just, you know, I'm not going to close my doors, but I'm just not looking for that right now. Mm-hmm. I'm just working and you know, just keep putting music out there. As far as like, cause you keep saying that you really like the old sound and like how people used to battle rap and stuff like that. Yeah. Tell me a little bit more about just like your battle rapping experiences, kind of like the likes um, yeah. and like things that you would want to see brought back if could be. Yeah, so like when, like I said, when I was um, like younger, it used to be like, like you know, old hip hop, like you, we used to battle just like, people that was nice at rapping, you know what I'm saying? Just battle people and then we go into actual battle events, battling people. And like, yeah, that, I feel like that was, that was like more lit, like era of hip hop because you was like going actually like face to face with people. Mm-hmm. It was crowds of people, like 
you had to say some fire shit for the crowd and really be like, oh, that was like, yeah. ooh, like he said some fuck. Like now it's like I said, like you say whatever on the track, you post to TikTok, it might go viral, you know what I'm saying? So it's different. But yeah, I think that's lit. like the more like, like in person. So would you still conclude yourself as a battle rapper or that's just something like you just nah. kind of like go watch? Yeah, that was just, that was just something for, like for the streets. For mm -hmm. it, was just, it helped me like sharpen my, like my talent with it, with the music, but it's not something I would like really want, like trying to do. Mm -hmm. yeah. What's your favorite line from one of your songs? My songs. Mm -hmm. I said, um, <laughs> oh, my song with song. I was like, bags, hundreds, every pocket. Clean up our folk. Got your bitch steady mopping. I said, <laughs> hold up. Uh, clean up our folk. Got your bitch steady mopping. Only fucking with your bitch for the taxes. Now, I fuck, yo, that shit is going crazy. I forgot how that shit went. So. I got to I got to shit. <laughs> yeah, that shit. Um, what's your favorite song that you got to do? Nah, this shit was hard when I said it though, and I freestyled this whole shit. Too much with drugs, they ain't making deposits She got that wet, 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 wet like a faucet Cops on my ass, got that crack, I'ma toss it I got no time for that bitch, I have to toss it Yeah, yeah Super Sonic running through these bags, bitch Skin in the phone with no tags, bitch With no average Break up on the counter, that's a bad bitch You can see the pressure with no glasses Platinum that was past tense Only fucking with it for the taxes Yeah, that shit was That was my favorite, I ain't gonna lie I had fun doing that, so I'm gonna freestyle that whole shit. That's but it was fire. It was fire. So would you go back to like rewrite or like recording the song that you previously previously done before? Um, you said what I what I re what I do it over? Like yeah, like re-recording the song or rewriting the songs and kinda like sharpening them a little bit. Nah, I feel like that's the vibe I felt at the moment. That's what I'm pushing for me. Mm -hmm. Yeah.